Well, Johnny, 5 1 away today, Carnoustie. Talk us through the game. Yeah, I wouldn't say we were at our best today, but you look at the scoreline and it's, uh, it's pleasing. 5 1 away from home. And I've said, um, hard to win away in the Super League, but we seem to be, we seem to be doing pretty well at, um, up to now, so long may that continue. Um, the game as a whole, I, I dropped down two or three notes first half, and especially the first 10 minutes. I'm, I think my, my notes were uh, slack, slack start, not working as hard as they were. Um, no one is no too good in possession of the ball. Um, but for a 15 minute spell after that slack start, we were, we were, we were really simply and now we played really good. And we, we moved them about, the movement between the strikers and the midfield runners, um, fullbacks overlapping, everything kind of came to play within a 15 minute spell and we found ourselves at the end 3 0 up. Um, and then we, we switched off and we let them back into the game pretty quickly after that, it was 3 1. Um, but we found an extra gear just before half time, kind of killed the game off as a, as a contest, uh, 5 1 at half time. Um, I challenged the boys at half time, asked for a wee bit more, asked them to kind of play better than they had. Although we were winning 5-1, I went in and challenged them and I asked them to go and win the second half. Fortunately, we didn't do that. And I think if we play like we did second half, and I told them that, we'll get beat. If we play like we did second half next week, we'll not win the match. So um, it's important that we, we kind of learn from it. We got away with a slack performance second half today. Um, I'll, be, I'll be stressing to the players throughout this midweek to make sure that we're better than what we were second half. But as a whole, the manager can't complain when your team wins 5-1 away from the uh, next week we've got Fault House, who got off the mark today with our first win. Yeah. Do you think that's going to, your thoughts going into that one? Their result today doesn't, doesn't change my thinking. I always knew they were going to go off the mark. Um, whether it was today, next week, or two weeks' time, they were always going to win a game, just like Carnoustie are always going to win a game. Um, I think it's just the Super League. No teams in the Super League go the full season without winning. Um, it was just important for me today, we were not the team that Carnoustie got their first win against. Um, obviously, the monkey's off the back for Faultus next week, but um, I'm expecting a tough game. I can't ever remember playing Faultus and it being easy, so um, next week will be tough and that will be drilled into players this week as well. We need to turn up, we need to turn up every week. We've not got a God-given right to win any game. Um, at this moment in time, we're in a good, good run of form um, and long may it continue, but I'm not naive enough to think that I've came to Penny Cook and we're going to win the rest of the season. That's not going to happen. We just need to take advantage of it. Well, we are on top and we're getting wee breaks of the, the ball and um, we'll try and get three points again next week.